Hey there guys. So, um, I haven't posted in basically forever. I think since early September, if I believe, or if I remember correctly. Anyway, that's unacceptable. So here I am posting again, also explaining, um, what's been happening. Um, basically I moved. This is the new house. Here's some mountains. Um, it's a pretty nice property. There's no shop, unfortunately. So, I basically haven't really been working on anything. Yeah, so I'm going to show you some things I've been working on in my workable time. And then, luckily, um, for me, Will Stelter is about eight minutes in that direction. And so, in about... 20 minutes from now, I'm going to be going over to his shop for work, to work for a couple hours. I'm going to help him out um, with some stuff, and that will be cool. So I'm going to show you some things I've done since I last posted. Here is the um, chef knife that I will be working on today over at Will's shop. I got the hand sanded choil looking nice now i need to work on the handle and guard fit up or bolster i guess i made this uh i call it the tiger shark tonto because it's like tiger stripes that's really cool Then also I've got this super cool Damascus, twist Damascus dagger with a titanium guard and um, ironwood handle. It still needs a pommel and I need to actually lengthen the tang, but it's getting close to done. And here is a Quaken, Quaken, however you say it. Um, I made this in early December. This is my favorite knife I think I've ever made. San Mai, Micarta, Brass, and then Micarta again. It is super cool. I want to make another one, but like slightly smaller at some point. It's actually quite a large knife. I think it has like six inches of cutting edge. Okay guys, I am currently on the um, on the road. I'm almost to his shop and those were just some things that I had um, been working on. I'd, I'd, done a, I'd done a couple other things since I last posted but I don't actually have YouTube quality videos of them, so yeah, I guess I will leave you be now. I mean, not really. I'm gonna turn off the camera basically, and then I'll resume filming once I get to the shop. All right, I am here at the shop. Here's Marty. Um, it sounds like Will's in the grinding room, so um, yeah, that's cool. I will find out what he wants done, and then work on my projects. Super, super extremely grateful that he's allowing me to use his shop. He's one of the nicest guys ever, um, and it's just great being neighbors. Okay, so I've got this chef knife clamped up. Um, I'm going to be redoing the um, shoulders on the tang because when I tapered the tang, I slightly ground out, and then I ended up doing more to the toil anyway, so it's, it's fine. So I'm gonna refile in these shoulders and all.
All right, guys, so that will be all for today's video. I got that chef knife um, fit up. It's looking great. I will probably not film the rest of um, making that, uh, but if you want, you can follow along. My Instagram should be right about there, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Tremendous thanks to Will for letting me use his shop. Super nice of him. Super grateful, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.